Hi everyone, this is the Seymour uh, EA9 HMI series panel unboxing and review. And detailed information contained in the video can be found at accautomation.ca. A link has been put in the description below. And if you've not watched the other videos yet, there's links in the description below um, that will show you the rest of the videos in the series as well. So looking at my box here, you see that I have model number EA9 uh, T10CL. So that is our box number. And the uh, it's a human machine interface, HMI. And they're made to display and control operations for your automation solution. Now information is displayed in a graphical format, graphical user interface, GUI. And the HMI is usually part of a SCADA which is supervisory control and data acquisition system and communications from the HMI to the control is usually done through a serial RS-232, 485 or 422 or it could be an Ethernet port um, and different protocols depending on the manufacturer of the control. Now the automation control device is not limited to the PLC uh, which is the programmable logic controller. You can also communicate also the drives, temperature controllers, process controllers. Um, and the HMI is usually, I will include, include several different protocols that you that the port can be configured to maximize the amount of control product that would be able to communicate to. So in other words, it's trying to be universal to everyone. So if we open this up, the first thing we pull out is our quick select guide. And that goes over uh, some of the uh, different features. So we'll just set that aside. And we do pull this out. And what we have taped here is our custom overlay. And we have our brackets that come in. see that we have our custom cutout panel so this is a fairly large unit an inch and if we open this further let's pull the whole unit right in Cast aside the boxes a little bit there. And this is the actual screen itself. So it's a, a fairly large unit. And if we look at the back of it, you see that we have our, our membrane here for our panel cutout. You'll also see our USB programming port located right here. We have port number two. Uh, we have the uh, port number three, it looks like an ethernet. We also have uh, another communication port just underneath over here. Oh, there's our ethernet port right, located right in there. So, communication port, USB port, located right here, there's our ethernet, and then we have a mic microphone in, we have a line out so that we can do audio, so, and then we have our, our connector right here, and looks like we have an expansion port located right here, cast that aside. So that looks like a, a good, and again, we just look at the brackets. There's our, our brackets that came with it to actually mount the unit and our overlay. And this is our quick select guide. So that is our unboxing. Now, this is a touch screen display, it's an LCD. And we have 10.4 inch 
diagonal uh, color uh, TFT thin film transistor it's an analog resistivity it's a 1024 by 1024 touchscreen that allows unlimited touch areas and it's programmed by uh, a programming software called EA9-PGMSW and we have 64,000 colors and it's 50,000 hour average back life. You see that we have the USB uh, port as we showed before you, and we have two actually USB one port B which is down programming and downloading and then we also have a USB port A available. Then we have our USB, we have an Ethernet, and we have remote access as well. And that gives us remote internet access. Serial PLC interfaces, again, RS-232, 422, 485. We have one built-in SD memory card slot. And this is powered by 12 to 24 volt DC. And there's an optional uh, 110 volt AC power supply that we can plug in the back. As you see with that expansion it was we have our audio out we have 226 megabits of project memory and we have data logging capability right on this unit now the operating temperature range is 0 to 50 degrees C so it gives you a wide range and it's a NEMA 4 4x IP65 compliant and then it's indoor use only so you can see that it's very slim design, so it saves, it's going to save you some panel space. Right. Again, this is all UL, U, uh, CUL, and CE agency approved, and we have a two-year warranty from date of our purchase. So if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button below. If you have any questions about this video, please leave a comment below and I'll do my best to answer it. If you want more information about us, or you want to get our free ebooks on numbering systems or robust data logging, please click on the link in the description below to get it. A new video is put out every Monday, so be sure to hit the subscribe button so you can get your videos just like this in the future. Remember to click the bell beside your subscription in order for the video to actually be um, shown to you. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.